All right, so Rustam, tell us where we are. We are in the old city. You see the Maiden Tower. Uh -huh. This is a symbol of Baku. What does having a Formula One race in town mean to the city? Very exciting because the, the teams which are coming from all the world to, to Baku, to Azerbaijan. We would like to show them our hospitality yeah. and would like that next year they will come. Hello, nice to see you again. Old city, uh, it is the center of uh, handmade carpets. Okay. And everybody, is, uh, especially uh, foreigners, know that they can buy handmade carpet just here in Old City. Uh, this one, it is silk carpet, 100% nature silk. How long does a carpet like this take? Around uh, seven, eight months. This is a, a hat for you? The hat for cowboys. <laughs> oh, this small one, you need the big. So a soldier, would you like to be? Yeah. Russian soldier. So what does Russia have to do with Azerbaijan? We used to be the, a part of, of the Russian Empire. And after 70 years in 1991, we again become the separate and independent country. So this is a very interesting place. Do you know uh, about the um, uh, Silk Road? This is the uh, rooms for the uh, sailors who came with the, with the caravan. How long ago was that? Two, three hundred years ago. You can see the small room. Uh -huh. In the past, it used to be a room for the sailor who from the China, from the India to the Europe. I explain how important oil is to Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan is a, uh, if we would translate it, a land of fire. So a lot of oil and gas at the end of 19th century, the beginning of 12th, the oil boom. You see the Baku become a uh, very modern European city. And they created these beautiful buildings around the old city. And now, after our independence of Soviet Union, bring here the big uh, events such as Formula One, use our uh, oil for the country, and you see the, how we are uh, improve our future for our kids. So what do, what do people use this for? This uh, woman put on their hat something like this. Oh my it looks, God. It looks good on you. Yeah. 